know him quite well. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. launches one to left center field and it's gone. His second in as many games. And it is now a five to nothing lead. And look at how far that one went. Easy swing. And he's certainly not trying to hit it 436 feet, but because he's in a, such a good spot right now, the ball jumps off his back. Last night, his home run went to right field. This one goes to deep left center. He's a special player, and you talk about Don Mattingly, recognize that right away. As soon as he got here, he said, boy, these guys are different. Mm -hmm. Bo and Vladdy, he picked out specifically. He's been seeing them from afar, and now he gets to see them close up. Well, what a blast. Mm, yep. He's strong. Yep. <laughs> Vladdy's back. Yeah. And again, we talked about him off the top of the show. If you look at some of the underlying numbers, the chase percentage, he's just not chasing pitches out of the zone much at all. He's only struck out once now in 32 plate appearances this season. If he doesn't chase and he makes them come to him, the ball goes a long way. I tell you what, Q, and this guy right here has something to do with that because Laddie knows he's got good protection behind him in Dalton Varsho, so he's not so concerned about swinging at those borderline pitches, and that's why he has five walks. Varsho himself hit 27 home runs last year. He hit a double his first time up. Last season, all season long, Laddie had one left handed hitter hit behind him all year. Rymel Tapia. <laughs> And he's not going to change pitcher's approach, worried about pitching to Tapia instead of Guerrero. Varsho might. 3 2. Hopped up and back out of play. This home run deserves another look. Boy, it sure does because he is so balanced and it's not a big swing, it's just a very compact, quick swing. And look at him drop the bat. Oh, what a feeling that must be to hit it and know it's a surefire home run.